There's another mover that I want to talk about that really caught my eye this morning, and that is Generac, mm -hmm. the generator maker. The shares down almost 15% after it warned it expects sales to fall more than expected this year. Now it's looking for a decline of 10 to 12 percent in sales yeah. this year. It had a forecast a decline of six to 10 percent. And all of this seems to be in its residential business, right. not in its commercial they business. They said that, exactly. But this is, um, you know, it, this is really a big, a big shift here. It is, and the CEO mentioned softer demand for, uh, consumer demand for home improvement. So to your point about the residential business, and, and you wonder if some of that is that story about like the decline that we've seen at, at, in, in people just doing home improvement uh, projects. Uh, I mean, but still, even with today's sharp move, year to date, the stock is still up 30 some odd percent. Mm. So, or around 30%. So, uh, you know, uh, so it's certainly not completely tanking shares, yeah. uh, but a big miss in terms of, you know, the both the sales decline and then expectations going forward. Yeah, I mean, it's so interesting to me, all of these stories that were the pull forward pandemic stories, right? right. This is one of these things where people were buying generators during mm -hmm. the pandemic. Um, because they were at home, they felt like they needed that backup. Um, and we're still sort of surprised. Right. You know, or at least surprised the by the was, magnitude. Right, because the trends were so strong then, you felt like there was, uh, you know, a tailwind to it. Yeah, and that it and would it, be sustainable to some degree at least. But here, um, this, this magnitude of this decline is really something. The company does say one small um, bright spot here is that it says its commercial business is going to hold up better. So you know, maybe that's something that could help cushion some of the blow from, from the, the residential side. I mean, if you look at the mix between the two, it's actually relatively even. So residential products net sales in the quarter were down 44% to 499 mm -hmm. million. Commercial and industrial up 24% to 384 million. So a little bit yeah. better on that well, point. Yeah, but not enough right. for the stock today. Yeah. All right.